In this video, I am going to analyze what you can get yourself on Timu for $30 and also see if those pieces of clothing are suitable for runners. Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Susie and this is I Run Things. In this channel, I film myself running, I film my races, and also from time to time, I review products that are either sent to me or purchased with my own money. This time we are going to analyze what $30 gets you on Timu and also see if those pieces of clothing, those items are suitable for runners compared to the quality of other pieces of clothing that you can purchase. So without further ado, Let's dig right in. So full disclosure, for my Patreons, I did a live unboxing when I received the box from Timu and I got the items out of the box. Actually, they came in a bag, so I can't call it a box because they were inside a bag. But I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven items. Actually, I got eight items. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight items. Eight items. One of them is something that runners can use but can't wear. So I'm gonna show you that first and then we'll progress to the rest. I will put the links to the items below and I will also show you in a little catwalk what they look like on myself. And then you're gonna see what I have to say about them when I try them out. All these items, except for the ones that you can't wash, have been worn a few times and washed a couple times. So, I feel like I know kind of the quality of these items since they have been washed twice and dried twice. Although I never dry my running clothes on a dryer, I always dry them outside on a rack. So for what it's worth, I treat or try to treat my running clothing for longevity purposes as, as nicely as I can. So, okay. Let's stop talking and I'm going to show you the items. Number one, this bottle was this amount of money. I'll put the money here for all the items. So it's 150 milliliters, which I think it's five ounces. I am actually not sure. Uh, does it say? Yes, five fluid ounces. It's right there. I figured I could use it for water. Now I, it's too small. I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do with this. I haven't used it and it came nicely wrapped. It has, let's see if the camera focuses now. It's nicely wrapped. So I know it hasn't been used, but I haven't used it myself either. So yeah. Next piece of clothing. I got this nice hat. I've actually worn it a lot. This is probably, this is gonna sound strange, but I love this hat. The price was unbeatable and yeah, it has this opening right here. If you wanna wear like a high ponytail like I'm wearing right now, or you can wear your ponytail through here, but it is super, super cute, super vibrant blue color. It has this mesh right here. So your sweat leaves your head as much as possible and it's 80% nylon, 20% polyester which means it actually wicks away sweat which I can vouch for this is much better than cotton hats honestly I wish I had purchased more I might purchase more so yes this I found a really good high quality hat moving on I'm gonna show you I ordered two brass I'm gonna show them to you and Here's the first one. I'll show you a close up. Again, my Patreons have seen this already. And okay, so I ordered two. One of them is this light pink, the other one is this gray. They're both the same thing. Um, they have this pattern in the back, and it's super nice. I'll put a video right now of what they look like on me, both of them. But yeah, the issue with these brass 
is that they don't hold that much. I am not big chested, but I have noticed a lot of bounciness in the videos when I have run with them. So for what it's worth, again, I'm not big chested and they don't hold that much. I left the cups inside these right here and I took them off of this. Reason being, the cups hold a lot of water. So to me, they're uncomfortable when they get wet because you're sweating. But without the cups, um, you are a deer in headlights, you guys. So yeah, they are very thin and um, inside they look like this. And yeah, I mean, I like them. They're super comfortable. It's almost like you could wear them as a top, to be honest, with like high-waisted jeans or something because they cover a lot of real estate in your body. So for what it's worth. I also ordered two skirts. This is the first one. It comes on camera super bright. It is not this bright. It's a little bit more towards, I guess, like wine color, that sort of color. But I have worn this a few times. As a matter of fact, I had to recover this from the laundry basket. So they're very, very nice and very comfortable. Now, you have potential for chafing. You're gonna chafe with this because they're short. So, yeah. I like this a lot though. And just for bonus extra points, every time I wear this skirt, people smile at me a lot more. Like I'm running and people say good morning and smile at me. Whereas if I'm wearing other stuff, people don't smile back. I don't know. It might be all in my head, but I think it's this court, you guys. The other skirt I got is this one. Now this one, it's, is it inside out? No. They're both um, small. Yes, they're both small. So this one is super, super flattering on me. Now, they're both short. So if you are shorter than I am, they might, you know, get longer on your body. If you're shorter than I am, these are gonna be really short because they're short on me. So this one has this super flattering flop here. Pockets in the left on this one as well as on the red one. I don't know why it's on the left, to be honest with you. Usually they are on the right, but this is so super and the crisscross right here, super flattering. It's very soft. It fits like a glob. I love boat skirts, to be honest with you. I would repurchase. I might actually get more skirts because they are unbeatable. And now I'm gonna show you the quote unquote running shoes. I would not use these for running, you guys. They are just not, they just don't offer support. Um, they're comfortable for walking. I use them to do my strength training as well, but I haven't used them for running and I'm not gonna use them for running. They sleep on and off. You don't even have to untie them because they are very flexible. Would I repurchase? No. I would repurchase the skirts. I would repurchase the hat. I would not repurchase the brass and this thing. Now there's yet another item. It's actually inside the washing machine. Washing right now, I bought socks. The socks are very comfortable. I mean, I usually don't have issues with socks though. So if you have issues with socks, you get blisters. I can't vouch for that because I usually don't get blisters. I have even worn like cotton socks for long runs, which I, I know it's a big no-no, but even then I haven't gotten blisters on my feet. So yeah, I don't know. I don't know that I would repurchase. I think from everything, the socks, you can find socks for like $2 to and a half dollars somewhere else. So they were not the most inexpensive item on this list. So now what happened is that after I purchased, I put on the basket all these items, Timu kicked in with $20 off because I reached the $50 of value. So that's why everything was only $30. My understanding is that when you're ordering from Timu, they kick in with like bonus. So this might happen to you as well. It might not happen to you, but I'm not sure how they award that or don't award that. But again, I had, 
items for I think it was 45 or 46 and then I added the socks and this to make it over the 50 so that I would get the $20 off and then get everything for 30. So yeah. So let me know in the comments below if you have used Timu and let me know what you think of maybe ordering from Timu. I know that I get a lot of commercials and ads on YouTube and Instagram and everywhere really about Timu. And um, honestly, the skirts are better quality than things I have gotten on Amazon. So, and the hat definitely is, again, this hat is super, super nice. So yeah, that means you don't have to spend a lot of money to get a good running kit. If you wish to watch more videos like this one in which I actually dig deeper and find out if you can buy stuff uh, more affordable prices, I recommend you check this video. It's on how to buy sneakers for an affordable price. And if you want to subscribe to watch more videos, click on my face. Run fearless, you guys.